You have reached the 911 police emergency line. Due to defunding of the police department, we're sorry, but no one is here to take your call. If you're calling to report a rape, please press 1. To report a murder, press 2. To report a home invasion, press 3. For all other crimes, leave your name and number, and someone will get back to you. Our estimated wait time is currently five days. Goodbye. I'm Donald J. Trump, and I approve this message. I want to make it absolutely clear. Rioting is not protesting. Looting is not protesting. It's lawlessness, plain and simple. And those who do it should be prosecuted. Fires are burning, and we have a president who fans the flames. He can't stop the violence, because for years he's fomented it. But his failure to call on his own supporters to stop acting as an armed militia in this country shows how weak he is. Violence will not bring change. It will only bring destruction. It's wrong in every way. If I were president, my language would be less divisive. I'd be looking to lower the temperature in this country, not raise it. Donald Trump is determined to instill fear in America because Donald Trump adds fuel to every fire. This is not who we are. I believe we'll be guided by the words of Pope John Paul II, words drawn from the scriptures. Be not afraid. I'm Joe Biden, and I approve this message. If you elect me, your taxes are going to be raised, not cut. What does that mean for you? More taxes taken out of your paycheck. Higher gas prices at the pump and utility bills at home. Skyrocketing medical bills. You'll compete with illegal immigrants to keep your job. An economy in ruins. President Trump is bringing jobs back. Historic gains. 10.6 million new jobs in four months. President Trump fixed our economy before. He's doing it again. I'm Donald J. Trump, and I approve this message. Donald Trump is lying again. Joe Biden will not raise taxes on anyone making under $400,000. Biden will close tax loopholes for big corporations. Trump's tax cut giveaway exploded our debt, so he's threatening Social Security and Medicare. Biden will make the wealthy and big corporations pay their fair share so we can protect Social Security and Medicare and invest in schools and health care. I'm Joe Biden, and I approve this message. Joe Biden's failed old liberal ideas would crush our economy just as it's recovering. Higher taxes on families, crippling regulations, trade deals that ship jobs to China. President Trump led us to the strongest economy in history. He did it his way, not the Washington way. And he's doing it again, renewing, restoring, rebuilding. 2.5 million new jobs, the biggest jobs increase ever. And he's just getting started. I'm Donald J. Trump, and I approve this message. My son Beckett was two years old when he was diagnosed with leukemia. He would get sick. Aubrey would take him to the bathroom, and she would rub his back. Our family is fighting this every single day. If Donald Trump gets rid of our health care law, my son won't be protected. We would have to be making some tough decisions about what medications we can afford. We need a president who will protect our health care, and that's Joe Biden. I'm Joe Biden, and I approve this message. I would be very scared if Joe Biden became president. I think Joe Biden's going to raise my taxes. Joe Biden will raise taxes and kill jobs. And the only barrier between us and socialism is President Trump. President Trump is the right person for this nation's economy. This is a president that has kept his promises. I think he's about the only politician that seems to get it. I will vote for President Trump because he cares about people like me. I'm Donald J. Trump, and I approve this message. Right now, we're at a crossroads. We've seen what can happen when we elect a leader determined to divide us. As president, Joe Biden will forge a new path by growing an economy that works for working families, getting small businesses back on their feet, and expanding access to affordable health care. Joe Biden will lead us on the path forward, paved with opportunity for us all. I'm Joe Biden, and I approve this message. I'm Donald J. Trump, and I approve this message.